Hello, in this video we're looking at the Erasma app. Erasma is an augmented reality app. So you could um, bring pictures and images to life by using a QR code, but that would take you to a link in a new window and wouldn't bring your video up or your animation up overlaying your image. So with the Erasma app, you can, instead of using a QR code as a trigger to take you to a new location, you can use an image as a trigger. So what we're going to do is go through and have a go at creating a Erasma augmented image. So first off, I've opened up the app. I've signed in with my email account. Um, as you'd expect, I'm going to click on the plus and it's going to ask me to photograph an image. And it will tell you with the bar. Red means it's going to be hard to recognize. Yellow is good, but green is better. And you can see that the dot, the white dot is in the green, which means this is a distinctive image which it, which it will recognize. So having got it where I want it in the frame, I press the button to capture the image. I can then choose to add my animation. So I can choose something from the device or I can choose one of their presets. I'm going to use one of the presets that they've already uploaded just for this demonstration, but you could go to device and then access a video from your camera roll. So I'm going to choose the Coke can. Having chosen that, I can press select and I can rotate it round and I can move it within the space I can then hit next again if I'm happy with the positioning. I can name it. And I can choose whether it's in a public area or private. And I can hit submit. And that will create it. And then when I hit done. Then I can click on the purple icon at the bottom and when I bring it over the thing it should start and there we are, it will start to play the animation. So you can imagine if students had the Erasmus app on their device and you set it so that the video was public, your, it was in your public Erasmus channel, you could then get your students having these short video animations appearing when they brought their device over an image that appeared on a handout or a poster within the classroom. So I hope you found that useful. Uh, enjoy playing with augmented reality. And if you like the video, please remember to subscribe to the channel and join me again soon.